um, Mum, uh, we're now in Attleborough. You've moved uh, to a lovely um, uh, care home uh, just near where Andrew and Vince live. Mm. And um, last time we spoke was in Italian for Italian relatives, but because uh, Amber and Louisa are here with me, and because we want to talk about 1955 onwards, um, what happened uh, after you got engaged yes. to, Le to Lino? Um, that was what year was that? It was the year of fifty-five. Okay, and um, you got engaged. Um, your your brother Goffredo yeah. had got married. They, were, um, they came for honeymoon. They just got married in sure. fifty-five. Okay. He came, you know, and then my brother Raymond was there already in Cairo mm -hmm. with the wife. So a little uh, get together a group of uh, people who are on my family, all my family. Family get together. My and sister uh, with her husband, my elder sister, and the Rita. Uh, oh, that's lovely. And uh, and um, what happened after that? What was the next big event? Um, we stay one year engaged till I prepare everything, got everybody you know, else. Eh? And then uh, we got married in the 27th of October, 1956. Lovely. And already the trouble, uh, the war nearby was, uh, uh, people were uh, afraid, you know, that there would be a war in the uh, all country, all the places. Farouk was, de uh, the, the King Farouk yeah, was deposed King in 1952. Um, was thrown out in 1952. And Cairo was burnt as Cairo, well? Cairo, a big revolution. In fact, they have in all three revolutions, but the big one was to toast the, the king and all the royal family and everything. And after that, they put a notice, all British people who are living there, had their own house and everything, eh? British, French, Jewish, but the other nationality they don't touch. They, are, oh. they stay. As they and it is, is that when Joe Albani, Joe and Natty Albani came to, to London? Yeah, yeah. They were, and, and, yeah. And also... Um, the, before the end of, of December uh, 1931, eh, uh -huh. they were pushed out. Oh, okay. But we know, we left on fe February 1957. Okay, and you came by boat to, boat, yeah. to London? By boat to, to Genoa. Oh, okay. In Genoa, we stopped. Mm -hmm. uh, they didn't want to, to to stay there in the hotel mm -hmm. because they said too much expenses and so on. After they all done to us anyway, and then we took a train from Genoa to London. Oh, that's, that's a long was, journey. Said, yeah, yeah, long journey. Long journey, but um, and it's. I was feeling so bad. Then I didn't know that when I uh, I reached the destination was a hostel. With a lot of uh, British people, all British. They were, you know? is, is this St. Stephen's yeah. Hospital in Fulham? Uh, uh, the Fulham, we, we stayed the night over there. St. Oh, okay. St. Stephen's. St. Stephen's. Mm -hmm. That was made especially for the people, who immigrants, who were host from their country, and they stayed there. They stayed one night. So, but so, then they wouldn't want us to stay there, so they took us to the Paddington Station, and then uh, we took the train to Gloucester. <laughs> Yeah, and Stroud, you went Gloucester, to Stroud, yeah? Yeah, Stroud, and the little town was Stonehouse, our place. Mm. Very nice place, so to say. Okay. A lot of people there were. So a lot of people were ousted from, 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 yeah. from Egypt. Yeah. Anyone with a British or, in Dad's case, a Maltese passport. What about his brothers? What happened to... Uh, um, My brother... Oh, no, Lino. sorry, to, to, to uh, Lino's brothers, Goffredo, oh. Totti... Um, excuse me, uh, sorry, brother. Toti and uh, Didi, what happened to them? Lino's brother, they were already out of the country for many years. Oh, okay. In fact, the eldest one took one of the last boats from um, uh, Alexandria to um, Sydney. Oh, okay. And after a few months, the man, the, the, the woman, uh, uh, followed him. Follow him. So, with the so children. Carol was only eight or eight okay. years old. Okay. So, so Totti yeah. uh, and um, okay. his wife. Um, Totti was Joseph. His name. Yeah, his real and name. The other one is Salvo. No, Salvo was with a big company, a Dutch company, uh, touring uh, Europe. You see, and a very very good boss. He was uh, a civil civil en civil engineer. He was civil in during the war. Yeah. Civil servant during the war. Also, Lino. Seven years mm. he did. Yeah, although I think but Dan, the other one, 
die ja, voor de uh, civilian, maar die was, uh, how do you call it, inspector hmm. and administration. Very, very good post. Okay. Had, uh, and his, and his did he... He school in uh, Salvo, you know, so. And, and Dino's brother. And he got a very good job, uh, English. English was already spoken in English. Sure. And can I just he's, sort of uh, to <laughs> clarify, Salvo, did he was Rita's dad, who's also Rachel's would have been Rachel's granddad, Totti being Harold's dad, uh, and uh, Alexander, Alex and Joe's um, granddad. And now they're all basically in Australia. Um, mm. Alex has just a few, a week or so ago, had a second child. Yes. Um, so that's, that's lovely news. And in fact, when I told, um, um, excuse me, Harold, that uh, to watch the video, he was very, very keen to watch it. And I, when I get back to him yeah, after exactly. Easter, I'll, I'll let him know. So um, that accounts for 57 yeah. uh, in Stroud or Stonehouse. Yeah. What, Stonehouse. What, what Stonehouse? So what happened? It's Did very uh, small, uh, smaller. Sure. Uh, so, not town, a little uh, center, you know. Okay. It so, was a big uh, place yeah. to, to accommodate us. That is a hostel. Hostel. So there was... Usually during the war, they, how is it here? And um, fatto domini soldati. Oh, the, the it was soldier, a barracks. Yeah, they, 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 they were, the soldier were stayed in this small little room. Barracks. Bed with the radiator and everything. And then we, they accommodate us this, then, then, till they see the situation, how it is. We stay five and a half months. Mm -hmm. So my mother-in-law, Nonna Zina, she couldn't stay because, uh, by the way, as soon as I wasn't feeling well, you know, took me to the doctor and he visited me and said, you know, you're a one man pregnant. What? One man pregnant? And all this suffering in the boat and so on must be something to do with that, yeah? And then and they start to, to take care of me, the doctor, the nurse and everything, yes. Okay, and so... I have good food, good food, but not always... Uh, uh, cooked properly, you see? Okay. Like in the morning when you have bacon and um, eggs and milk and the porridge, whatever you want, uh, sandwiches, uh, whatever one think about, a big, huge breakfast. Okay, so can I ask, and yeah. without interrupting, I know I'm interrupting yeah. a lot, but... How long uh, for me this morning? Yeah, oh, good, oh, good. So, because um, I gave him your number. Yeah. Um, when, how come you ended up in London then? And Muswell Hill especially. I ended up in London because Lino, with his cousin Salvo, who was living in Ilford, they were coming from the hostel to the uh, Anglo-Egyptian Aid Society. This name is made because the, the, all the money the English government took from the foreigner people who left their money in their banks and because uh, Mr. Eden was at uh, the, the time, well, that time was uh, Prime Minister, he said, look what they done to, to our people. Is enough? Not enough? They suffer a lot with, with war. All this, uh, uh, how do you call it, uh, um, the privation and so on. So we take all this money to keep these people here for us. See? Because they, uh, the Egyptian government got a very big mistake to... to, to this uh, uh, um, expel, yeah. expel the uh, yeah. British yeah. patriots, and that's uh, right. So, yeah, so every few weeks they were going, um, uh, Lino and Cisalvo go to the Anglo Egyptian this, uh, dead society that means the money the Egyptian sell to us, you know, it was good for us for, for a living. He said, We want to find a job, find a job, find a job. They were walking, walking, walking miles. All the place to find a job. At the end, he find the job at the uh, what is it? The hotel or the uh, oh, um, Claridge's or uh, Savoy? Savoy. Stay six months at the Savoy because he's very good in accountancy. Very good. Very first of the class. But also, he, in his office in Cairo, he does everything. And so they were happy with him. And he said, "Can I have a transfer to another place?" All right. We send you to Claridge's and stay 11 and a half years out there. Mm -hmm. He was teaching people, apart his job, teaching people how to, to take an office and a, a accountancy and everything. Yeah. Okay. I was quite happy then. But they, they say, look, with the, uh, you have also the, uh, over time, we cannot give you more money than that. 
Your salary was in 15 or 16 pounds a week. Wasn't enough, but this Anglo Egyptian A Society, they provide us to have an apartment, a flat, pay the rent, and help us to live because we have no money. Okay, and we can I? Yeah. I'm going to round it off very shortly, yeah, but yeah. Um, so it's you right, came right. to London, and, yeah, what, to London right? and what happened? I know the answer, and you'll, hopefully you'll tell me. Are you were pregnant, and what happened in October of 1957? Okay, Vincent was born. Okay, and do you want to tell us something? We, we were, we, in October 1957, we got married. We got married, 27 October 1957. And then we stayed a few months, till Lino and all the British people, the French, were lost their pops, their, their job. Beautiful salary, so, Eric, had to leave, to leave the job, and so we had to go. Had yeah, to no, go sorry, Mum, I think, I think it's slight confusion. Yeah. You got married, leave, you got married 56, and Vincent got married, uh, got, uh, was born in 1957, yeah? Yeah. So, um, so wh was where was it? Beautiful house. Okay. After we went one, sorry, one, one month in that uh, rented uh, flat, one month, one year, the same year, Lino was find, uh, searching for a, a house and so on. He found that, that house where you were there. Coney Hatch Lane. Coney Hatch Lane, yeah. Muswell Hill. And so that wasn't four far and from... Years or something like that. For about how many years? Uh, you lived there for 30... 57? Uh, no, actually almost 50 odd years. And yeah, um, yeah. you were very close to yeah. Joe Albani, to yeah. um, Natty Albani, yeah, yeah, and yeah. to uh, Joe, uh, Joe and uh, Ines... Yeah. Um, um, excuse me... Uh, Ines... Uh, Ines, yeah, no, Ines, Ines came uh, yeah. to England in um, in September. For, um, okay, Scott but what was her uh, what was her surname? Joe um, Ines Ines. What Floridia. Was it? Floridia. Okay. All right. Let's stop there because it's no, twelve it's minutes. Yes, yeah. Let's stop there. It's twelve minutes. So a uh, quick wave. Uh, and uh, do you want to wish everyone a happy Easter? Yeah, I wish happy so, Easter to everyone, all the family, all what? the relatives, all the people I know. Un bacio. Good health and happiness always. Un bacio a tutti. Um, <coughs> a big kiss to all of <laughs> Thank you.